Hello boys and girls, welcome back to another Azita review. Now in today's video we're going to be chucking the brushed impact driver up against the brushless impact driver, doing a little bit of a head to head, see which one can drive in a bigger screw or drive in the screw more quickly. But just before we start, I need to say that I paid for these out of my own money. No one knows that I'm doing a review on these. No one has asked me to do a review. These have been bought by me for a purpose of my own review. So on the left we have the brushed impact driver. This is the PXIDS 300. It has a no load speed of 2300 RPM, an impact rate of 2900 IPM and a torque of 150 newton meters. And on the right we have the brushless impact driver that has a no load speed of 2900 RPM, it has an impact rate of 3000 IPM or BPM and has a torque level of 180 newton meters. They will both be running 4 amp batteries. This is 49 bucks and this is 99 bucks. Some other features is that this on the nose is plastic, this on the nose is rubber. These lights don't stay on when you stop pressing the trigger because it's brushed. These lights stay on when you stop pressing the trigger for about 10 seconds. These lights on mine don't go on at all because I threw this off a ladder in frustration. You would have heard that if you watched the original review. I've done reviews on both of these drivers. Now I want to give these a little bit of a head to head, see which one can pull out on top. So for that I've got a spade bit over here which is 25 mils or 1 inch in diameter. This has been used so it is a little bit used obviously. Then after we see how it can drill that hole I've got some screws. These are the same screws, screws that I've used for all the testing that I've done. So 10 gauge 35 mil timber screws. Then I've got 14 gauge 50 mil batten screws, then 14 gauge 100 mil batten screws, or that's 2 inch 50 mil or 4 inch here. Then I've got 14 gauge 200 mil batten screws, so 8 inch. And if it can do that, well, then we've got a foot long coach um, landscaping screw. Sorry, I'm not going to be putting in any coach screws because. They are fucking bolts and they are just so tough that it's just not going to be worth it. And of course we've got some bits to drive them all in. The brushed will be on the left side of the screen and the brushless will be on the right side of the screen. gonna do that and I tried multiple fucking times and I've actually broken the spade bit. See how one of the teeth on the end aren't there? That's what happens when you buy a piece of shit fucking boards. So with that I think we'll just go to screws thank you very much. Alright, so let's check the battery level after some failed spade bit attempts and some screw tests. That one's still showing full lights. And so is that one, there you go. Now a little bit of a discrepancy is that in the original review of this driver, you might have seen the 8 inch batten screw get driven all the way in. That's because that was old wood. Um, this didn't get this didn't get the eight inch all the way in on this time because it's a hell of a lot newer wood. It doesn't have any cracks or grain strips or anything like holes or anything. It's it's fucking tough wood. So I'm sorry, but after I'm sweating like a pig, I'm not gonna go out there and and do another bloody screw test to see if if I can get it up, if I can get the eight inch in on the second go. And I know that I said that I have a landscaping screw. 
But, you know, this didn't even drive in V8 inch, so I, I would feel that it's an unfair test to put uh, put it up against the landscape and screw it against a much tougher model. But nonetheless, I hope you did enjoy this video, and I'm sorry that I haven't been keeping up with videos. I know this video is like three months after the last video got posted, I'm very sorry about that. I just didn't really have the motivation, I think I just needed a break, and... I'm back from the break and a lot more videos are going to start coming out now. So I hope you enjoyed this review. If you did, please consider chucking it a like and possibly subscribing to the channel. And until the next one, we'll see you in the next video.